What happens at Weight Watchers Club's Gene Idich, founder of Weight Watchers, has died. A million people are members of the weight loss clubs she created, but what goes on at them and how do they work? Those who have joined Weight Watchers speak of the buzz of stepping on the scales and realizing they've lost a few pounds. Around 1 million people are weighed, one by one, at 40,000 weekly club meetings globally. Individual performances remain secret, but the total amount lost or gained by the group since the last session is topped up and revealed. The emphasis is on doing it together. The 10,000 leaders running the groups, providing a fun and informative talk each time, have been through the Weight Watchers program themselves. It's more than 50 years since Jean Idich, who had struggled with her weight since childhood, started the first group in New York. Members are introduced to a points-based scheme, under which those wanting to lose weight keep scores for the week, effectively noting down their calorie intake and not exceeding their specified limit. They are encouraged to stick to a plan, ensuring the reduced weight is sustainable, and check food labels. This is known as tracking. The points plans vary a little by country. In the UK, the Pride Points system allows individuals a daily allowance of points, based on height, weight, age and sex. These do not simply represent calories, but take into account protein, carbohydrate, fat and fiber content. There is an extra allowance of points over the week on foodstuffs not normally recommended, such as beer and biscuits, by way of a treat. It takes into account how your body processes food and nudges you towards healthier, more satisfying choices, says the company. So, when you follow Weight Watchers do not think you will eat less, you will however eat better than ever before. You may find yourself surprised at all the wonderful foods you can enjoy if 